Hello and welcome back to Gym Insight. In this video, we're going to be going over several front desk member concern tasks. During a gym's prime time, member concern issues can be the root cause of missed membership sales. One of the most common member concern issues is updating a credit card. Let's do that now. Simply click on accounts at the top. You could search for a member here or go to your member list. Pick your member out. Select Payment Info at the top navigation bar and select New Payment Method. Once that's selected, choose if it's a credit card or an ACH. Select what type of credit card it is or debit card. Put in the expiration. Make sure the billing information is correct and click Save. Another very common front desk member concern issue is freezing an account. Let's go ahead and do that now. Let's click accounts at the top and search for that member by name. Pick the correct member from your member list and simply click freeze. You have two options to freeze this member. You can freeze on a specific day with how many months you would like the account frozen or you could freeze the account immediately with how many months frozen. Put in the correct reason for the freeze. And click the freeze account button. Another very common member concern issue is the dreaded membership cancellation. Let's go ahead and do that now. Search for the member that's leaving. To cancel a membership, all you have to do is click the cancel button and you're greeted with two options. You could cancel the account immediately or you could select a certain cancellation date, maybe if you have a 30 day notice. Put in the reason why they're canceling, of course they're moving, and click cancel. That completes a membership cancellation. For the next membership concern, let's go ahead and add an extra key. Maybe the member lost a key or it's no longer working. So let's go ahead and do that now. Okay, go to the membership profile. Scroll down to where it says Active Members and click View. Click on New Access Key and just punch in the new key number. The description and click Save. You've just added a new key for that member. If a membership add-on is your member concern, you can go back to the account Scroll down to Active Members and just click the Add Member button. Let's add a membership now. In the description, you could put anything that's going to help you remind yourself of adding this person on. Click Save. And now let's change the monthly dues of this membership. This member add-on was $20, so we're going to click Edit and just change the monthly dues for an extra $20. Click Update. And that's it, you've just added a member.